What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Liquid Crystal walkthrough. Okay, so in the last episode we went through Route 44, defeated a whole bunch of trainers, and we tried getting into the Ice Fall, but unfortunately, uh, well actually it's the Ice Path, there was an Ice Fall, and so we can't get in there, and then next thing you know it, we get a call from Professor Elm. Apparently there's something uh, going on over in uh, Ecrotech City. Something having to do with the legendary Pokemon. Now that is what's causing all this rain to ha like to, to just go on and stuff. As you can see, everywhere, wherever you go, it's going to be raining. And uh, that is going to be a very, very a bad, bad thing for all of us. Because you know what happens when lots of rain happens, legendary Pokemon who's pissed, that kind of crud. Yeah, so now we have to go straight to the Tin Tower. Let's see. I have two towers, east and the west. Okay, so the tin tower will be right here, and right before you go in, Yusin and Yusin and uh, Morty are here, and they're like, "Hi, ah, Draven, you're here. I've been looking for you, or I've been looking over oh, are you every, everywhere. It's Suicune. He's returned to the tin tower, but something's not right with him. Why would he want to flood Johto? And then Morty's like, I think it has something to do with Team Rocket's attack on the radio tower to try and control all Pokemon. That's it. Jo or Suicune returned to flood Johto to destroy Team Rocket. Still, he must be stopped before the whole uh, the whole jo uh, before the whole of Johto gets flooded. Draven, you are the only one who can stop the Suicune. I know I have been looking for Suicune for a very long time. This is my chance to see it in a in a battle for the first time. But I know you are the only one that can that he will choose. You are legendary trainer Draven. Oh shit, we're legendary trainer. Fuck yeah. You seen is right. You are the only person who can calm Suicune. Now, quickly, let's go into the tin tower and calm Suicune down. Alrighty, let's do this. Let's get this. Okay, so here we are, and uh, you seems all like we come to calm uh, Suicune. Please let us through. I'm sorry. But nobody's allowed in the allowed in, to enter the tin tower as Suicune has returned and is very dangerous. Only a trainer with a pure heart and carrying the clear bell is allowed to enter the uh, to calm Suicune. The clear bell the clear bell was lost ages ago. It was last seen in one of the four chambers in the ruins of Alf. All hope of finding the clear bell is lost. Draven, you must go to the ruins of Alf and find the clear bell. You have to be quick, Draven, before it's too late. Hurry up and get the clear bell. We will be waiting for you. Okay, so that kind of, um... Okay, so that kind of answers the question about where in the hell is the clear bell? So now we're going to be going straight to the Ruins of Elf, and you know something? This is actually... To me, this is actually, like, a very good thing that they're doing right now, involving the Ruins of Elf in, in such a way, because... I always thought that the Ruins of Elf was like, you know, it was like rather unused and all that stuff. It was just, uh, you know, just there for filler and all that crud. But, let's see, Pokemon, Soul Silver, Heart Gold, it is used as a place to just like, you know, I guess, to, to see the legendary Pokemon in other regions. But in this one right here, this is good. It's very, very good. And, let's see, look and touch. Okay, sliding to little stone panels right here. So... Here we are in the ruins of Alf, and uh, let's see, who do we have to go to to get a clear bell around here? All right, if we talk to this guy, the ruins are about 1,500 years old, but it's not known why they are built or by whom. And then there are odd patterns drawn on the ruins. It must be keys to unraveling a mystery of the ruins. Okay, so they're saying the same exact thing. And uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. What if we surf? Now we can surf, right? Yeah, we can. And uh, let's go right ahead and use a, a what was it, repel right here. Okay, so now I'm interested. And okay, so crud bat. Okay. Okay, so this is some BS right here. This is some BS. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm actually gonna go back to a town where I can actually get some freaking repels because this is ridiculous. Every single spot I go to, I never have a repel or something like that, or the amount of repels. So let's go straight back here and talk to somebody that could give us some repels. All right, let's see. Why don't I have repels? And are you serious? Okay. All right. 
I gotta speed through this whole thing because uh, time is money, money is pizza, pizza is knowledge. All right, let's go right here, radio tower. All right, so like I said before, it is uh, raining everywhere. Let's see, it's raining cats and dogs everywhere, guys. Let's see. Nope, he doesn't have repels. Who is selling repels? Ah, here we go. All right. All right. The hell? Oh, okay, so. What the hell? Okay, so I don't have any room for any kind of repel, so let's go ahead and sell some stuff. Uh, let's go with protein, X special, uh, guard, ice heal. Okay, let's buy now. Okay, so now we're gonna be buying a bunch of repels right here. Okay, so there we go. We are not lacking in repels anymore, and now we can go back to the ruins of health. And let's go back. Right here. Okay, so we're speeding through. Look at that. We're speeding through like Superman in, uh, in the Flash. Do, 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 do. I'm back, baby. Alright, so here we are. Actually, what the hell am I doing right now? Let's go and surf into this place right here. And let's go. Use a repel right now. Okay, so now nobody's gonna attack us, which is always good. Okay, so there's nothing. I guess we have to solve the puzzle right here. I, I, I don't know. I don't know where to go. So there's going to be a, a test right here. Welcome to this chamber. There are sliding panels that, that depict a Pokemon drawn by the ancients. Slide the panels around to form the, uh, the picture. To the right is a description of the Pokemon. Scientists in the back are examining some newly formed patterns. Alrighty, and let's see. Recently, strange cryptic patterns have appeared. It's odd. They aren't here a... They weren't here a little while ago. You should take a look at the walls. Let's see, what does it say? Boy. I can't, I can't take a look at the, anything right here. Alright, hold on. Oh yeah, I'm watching a movie too. <laughs> I'm watching somebody get, get in their buckets. Let's kick. Okay, so let's go right ahead and see what we got right here. Let's see. A Pokemon that hid on the seafloor, eyes on its back, scan the area. So it's a Kabuto. Alright, so let's see. Okay, so, wow. This is, uh, this is rather abnormal right here. New way of how to do it. Alright, we're gonna, gonna get the corner sides first, and then... Okay, okay, where the hell? Oh, here we go. God dang it, where? Okay, right there. Right there, let's see. Kabuto, you will be mine. Let's see, hold on just a sec, right? God dang, okay, here we go. Right there. Right there. Okay, so we're doing something right here. We're solving a puzzle. Right there. Uh, so I've got the whole thing wrong. All right, here we go, and here we go. Okay, so look at that. We're, we're, okay, we're, yeah, we're doing a good job. I always get those top parts all confused and everything, and here we go. Look at that. Okay, so there's Kabuto. And after that, holy crap, I am uh, falling. And here we are in the Ruins of Elf, and I'm going to try and locate this whole thing now. If we run it around, I don't think any kind of Pokemon will... Okay, there, I, I lie. Yes, you will find a Pokemon. And here's our very first one, Unknown D. I'm not going to capture you, so let's get the heck out of here. we got to find that uh, Clear Bell or something. Not the Clear Bell. That's Z. Okay, let's go. Let's use a Repel. There we go. Is there anybody here? No. Okay, so let's get the heck out of here before they start... Unleashing hell on us. Okay, so let's see. Talk to this guy. While exploring the ruins, we suddenly noticed an odd presence. We all got scared and ran away. You should be careful too. The ruins has uh, hide a huge secret, I think. Well, I already know that. Alright, let's go ahead and start surfing. Erwin, right here. And uh, one of the things that I don't like about repels, it's only 100 steps. Alright, let's see. What does this middle portion say? Nothing. Can't even read it, so they, they messed up right there. A flying Pokemon attacked its prey like with its saw-like fangs. 
And that, that must be... Okay. What the hell? Okay, so this has already been put into place, so I guess you can only solve one... One thing. What the hell? Alright, so let's see. Alright, we already took care of that. So what, what, what what's going on right here? Like... Am I missing something here? Let's see, the Pokemon's under the beer, gonna do, yeah, investigate this. This guy, strange, uh, drawings over there. Hmm, that's what I mean, there's many kinds, okay, okay. So, let's see. What am I missing? What am I missing right here? Huh. Okay, so I'm gonna pause it right here because I'm a little confused right now since I'm at the real ruins of Val, so I'll be right back, guys. Okay, I'm back, baby. So I kind of looked it over, and we're not supposed to be in here to look for the, uh, whatchamacallit, the, the, the bell. We need to go elsewhere. Um, and this is actually thanks to a channel, that, or a video that I saw off of a channel that... I wouldn't say it's my favorite. Actually, I just saw that, well... The video I watched, it came off of a channel. I don't think it's being used anymore or anything like that, but the, the walkthrough was done, like, about ten years ago. And... Yeah, the commentary was god awful, god freaking awful. It was uh, it was bad. It was very, very bad. And yeah, one thing that I, well, the thing about me here is, guys, now that we're now 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 that we're here and all that stuff, I am going to be on a little bit of a rant when it comes to the walkthroughs and stuff because it, this kind of like triggered me or something. So the video I watched was uh, where to locate the crystal, the the clear bell and all that stuff, and. It came off of a channel that is not being used anymore, and actually, uh, yeah, th th this video was done like about 10 years ago and all that crud, and, you know, I, the commentary was quiet, you could tell that this kid was just a kid at the time and all that stuff, and, and then when he went into the Suicune thing, he started calling the Pokemon uh, Gaycoon and all that stuff, and for me, yeah, that doesn't fly right there, that's why, you know, in the beginning, that's why you guys uh, don't necessarily didn't necessarily see me uh, like come out with any kind of nicknames and all that stuff because, you know, I go around and I start checking around on all other walkthrough videos and stuff. Some walkthroughs that I like, some that I don't like, and you know, sometimes, like sometimes people just uh, they when they nickname Pokemon and all that stuff, call them something vulgar, something uh not necessary and all that stuff and I, and I like I know I'm not the best person out there to say this I'm, I know that I'm very vulgar and all that stuff but that's my style going in here but you don't hear me saying you don't hear me saying uh, like uh, offensive words like gay queer or you know the F word you don't hear me saying that because that I don't believe I don't necessarily believe that and as soon as I started watching this kids walk through like reviewing all that stuff I'm like dude seriously come on like, the reason why you don't get any walkthrough uh, subscribers is because of that crap. So, again, if, they, if there's something that really pisses off Draven, it's, uh, it's, uh, intolerable people. People with, uh, just, a uh, you know, y you guys know what I'm talking about. So, I'm actually glad that, uh, that, that, that YouTuber's gone because, god damn, seriously, Gaycoon, seriously, calling it Gaycoon? Like, I know there's a lot of YouTube again, there's a lot of YouTubers out there that calls a kid, uh, their Pokemon, like, penis, or, or, uh, a shithead, or something like that, but, yeah, I don't necessarily want to do that, because, again, yes, I know that kids still watch my walkthroughs and whatnot, but, the thing is, the thing is that I don't try and condone or say any of these, like, uh, these trigger words that they get community or people angry about. I don't even say the N-word. I don't say that because, you know, that's not right. For me, it's not right. I mean, I know sometimes it's a word of endearment, but I still don't say it. Still don't say that because, uh-uh. That is ridiculous. And, uh, that is my... That right there is my, uh, two cents right there. So now you know, guys. Draven does not like... Does not like certain words. Some, well, some words trigger him. And, well, let's go right ahead and take this out. And actually, give it to Smoke right here because, uh, let's see. Go with Smoke. Let's give that to Smoke right here. Okay. So, by look, well, after looking at over the video and all that stuff, like I said, didn't really like it because, uh, yeah, the, the commentary was all wrong and the guy talking was just a, just an ignorant kid and all that stuff. I get it's a kid, whatever. But, 
you do find an added feature to this, which is uh, kind of fun. It's very fun. It's very creative, too. So here we are out in the ruins of Alf, and all you need to do now is go right here. And let's see. I think... Wait, this is not the right one, right? No. Actually, we can't go right there. Let's see. I think it's the one right behind us. Yes, it's right there. And... Oh, damn. We are waiting for the legendary trainer who has a pure heart and seeks the clear bell to make the three beasts, or to tame the three beasts. And uh, we sense that you are that trainer. You are here to seek the clear bell. I can take you to the clear bell. All you have to do is step into, uh, into the tile in front of you. Oh, damn. Kind of ominous, if you think. To get the clear bell, or to get to where the clear bell lies, you must travel through time to an island just off of uh, the coast of Johto. When you find the clear bell, you can use it to return to this time. If your Pokemon get injured and uh, you can't go, on, uh, and you will return to this time. If you fail to obtain the clear bell, then this storm will flood the whole, the whole of Johto. What the hell? With the clear bell in hand, you can tame the three beasts and save Johto. Do you want to go to the past? Yes. Okay. If you believe in yourself, you will find the clear bell. All right, so here we are in New Island, and this is exactly where you'll find the clear bell now. This is pretty cool, so I'm just gonna be seeing what kind of Pokemon you could find here. Regular Raditas and stuff. All right, let's see. Hell, or Wingles and all that stuff. Let's try, let's try that attack, okay. And what else can you find right here? Hopips. Okay, all right, so I'm starting to dig this place. Very creative. And as you can see, you go inside another cave right here, and I'm assuming that Pokeball is the clear bell or whatever. And here we have a Diglett. Wow, these are Pokemon that you'll yeah, you'll find elsewhere. Let's see. We've got great balls right here. Throwing this. And I didn't know that that could affect it. Alright. I'm gonna try and capture these Pokemon right here. Oh, crud. Okay, so... Let's see, let's see. Talk to Batman. Let's go. Right here, Great Ball. There we go. And... No. Let's see. Jigglypuffs. Pretty interesting Pokemon you can find right here. So, yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. If I can't capture these Pokemon now in Johto, then what makes me think that... Okay, well... Let's see. Okay, so we're out here, and... We got more Pokemon attacking us. So yeah, I'm gonna try and capture as many Pokemon as possible. Just to fill up the PC and all that stuff. Oh damn. Maybe I can capture this Pokemon right here. Okay, so there's a stun spore. Don't want that. And we're just gonna get the hell out of here. So let's go up ahead and see where this will take us right here. And here we have Eradicate. Need to get the heck out of the way. Well, maybe it's time to put on a goddamn repel, so let's go right ahead and, uh... Let's go right ahead and, uh, let's see, hold on, where are you? Right here. There we go, and let's see where we're at. Okay, so here we found an item, an HP up. Nice, if you wanna, if you wanna extend, well, increase the HP of your Pokemon just a little bit, and... Here we are in another location, so let's see, I'm just gonna waste another repel, and... Here we have a Weeping Bell. Kind of hoping that they would like, there's like rare Pokemon right here. Like some kind of rare Pokemon that you can't find. And of course, Wingle is not one of them. All right, so let's go ahead and use another Repel. You don't need to be battling another Pokemon right here. There's nothing here. So let's go see where this takes us. Matt, we found this, the Dragon Scale. Very good item. And Let's see, I kind of feel like I need to go up here first. And yes, I was right. We found ourselves a metal coat. So I could actually trade my Pokemon now. And let's go right here. Going up top. And here we are, what, what I would assume would be the top of uh, the island. So let's see what goes on right here. Oh damn, oh damn, it's a hoe. 
And it looks like it's sleeping. The hell? So it's asleep. Alright, so... The hell? Okay, so let's go ahead and talk to it. Obtain the... Okay, so we got the clear bell right here. And after that, he wakes up. And homeboy is flying us to the next island right there. What the... Oh, damn. Okay, so... What do we do here? This looks like the Steel Tonics or the Tectonics, uh... Memorial. So, let's see. There's something carved into the rock. Those who carry the item of soothing sound may re be returned to what they know best. So, we took out the clear bell and... BAM! Here we are in the burnt tower. Oh, damn. Okay, so... <laughs> Look at that. Okay, so we're back to Ecrotech City. In the next episode, we will be trying to capture Suicune. And, uh, you know, try and get a hold of, like, try and get a grasp of what the whole thing, what's going on right here. So, thank us for watching. I'll see you guys next time.